guys it's almost afternoon actually um, but still morning I am headed out to the store to pick up some last-minute Christmas items because it's Christmas Eve yeah um, but yeah I don't have much going on just like I said a couple last-minute gifts and I'm going to try and vlog today and tomorrow to put together hopefully a good amount of footage we'll see I'm not sure how much I'll catch but I hope you guys enjoy watching so I'm proud of myself guys I got in and out of Walmart with everything I needed in under an hour so and it was busy but um, quick tip if you're shopping on the holidays, definitely go to the electronics or sports area. I was able to check out with one person in front of me um, at the sports zone. So definitely don't follow the crowds and see. Um, I had to ask an associate who was in charge of the sports area, but um, they got there pretty quickly. So I, yeah, I'm excited I got out of there. Under an hour. Woo -woo! One more stop and then I'll be back home to wrap presents. All right, so you guys have to disregard the mess of this room. I'm still getting organized. Um, this is the baby's room. I'm out of breath, I just walked up the stairs, sorry. But I'm about to wrap presents, so enjoy. done the camera kept turning off on me so I just gave up but here's a little bit of it some of it's already in the car yeah we're on our way to my aunt's house for Christmas Eve and Christmas morning and let's show you guys when we get there all right guys so failed a little bit I am just now bringing out the camera we've already opened gifts but I'm gonna take you around show you my aunt's awesome house because she did a fabulous job decorating let me go over here first. Woo, it's chilly. Check it out. It's actually Christmas in Florida because it's cold. Fireplace. Look at all the table settings. Isn't that cute? She did such a good job. And you guys, my grandma decorated this tree. Looks professionally done. Say hi, Papa. You're on camera. <laughs> Bentley, I like your elf shirt. Finally getting the season coming to hang out. Likes to hide. The bubble bread. All right, I'm ready for my milk bomb. Any any left? Yes. Yes, there is, but you have to wait till the boys get back because we we're ran out of milk. milk. Oh. There's milk out there in a cooler. Okay. Okay. okay so grab, grab milk. So I'll be back once we have milk. So I just saw these. Oh, on the Daily it. Davidsons. The whole thing. Okay, go ahead, eat that they one. are hot chocolate bombs. These two are eggnog actually, but I'm not going to do eggnog. This is the regular okay, hot chocolate bomb. Yes, try that. Mm -hmm. But I don't want to, you said you got it for Kylan. Okay, uh, we're about to eat. Um, these got stepped on, but I'm going to use it. It might be 20 minutes so though. This is what it looks like. We're going to step on the bomb here. Do that, do that. So we're not ready to eat? Yeah. No. I can't see with my glasses. Oh, you got a tripod. 
Good luck, Jason. Yeah, sit down. We gotta call Daddy. Call Daddy. Hi, Mommy. You call him. Gotta kind of stir it. You put that on the table behind you. Should you have it? getting back on the road about to see the family part two and the corona back there is full of baby yeah. stuff it's not a box of uh beer just for anyone who's wondering but yeah this morning was really great it was fun seeing everybody and getting together sorry i was a terrible vlogger and you missed christmas but hope you enjoyed the decorations because they were awesome and yeah i'll do better this next round <laughs> It looks like this Christmas vlog is going to be a three-parter. Um, I don't know, remember what I recorded last, but I'm in the nursery cleaning up. I'm going to get organized, so I'll show you guys before. It's a hot mess in here, a little mix of mine and hers. And I will show you guys the after once I'm done. Just want to give you guys an intermission. This is an update. Really all that's changed is I've cleared the center of the floor, but actually I didn't show you the closet to begin with, but I have a few more things. I'll show you the in between here. Um, I switched my clothes from here to over there. My shoe rack was where you see this sitting. I had it there. Um, all the shoes belong on that last, that last row right there. I had it there, um, but my dresses were sitting on top of my shoes, and so what I'm going to do is slide that over, and then leave that open. I'll probably put the tub underneath there, but it'll be open for a dresser I'm bringing in. Um, that'll be about the same height, just for storage for the of this stuff. So yeah, still working. Um, Hoping I can get rid of those crates. Those are from when we moved in here in October. And I just don't have anywhere to put the stuff. So I'm hoping that I can find... It's not that I don't have a place for it. It's I don't have a shelf or anything, anything to organize it with. So comment down below suggestions of what I should do or what I should buy really to store some office stuff, some books. I mean, I could just buy a shelf, but yeah, I don't know. I haven't figured it out yet. I'm trying to decide. I'm hoping by organizing the room completely that I will have an idea. Something will come to me. But comment down below. I would love to hear your suggestions. Um, yeah. So the room is still not put together all the way anyways, but I completely sanitized that over there and the coverings are in the dryer right now. Same with 
the Gretco. Um, those are the parts to the infant bed. That's the changing table. I haven't put it together yet. It has diaper cream. Um, it's a hand-me-down, so it's got diaper rash cream in it. And I just looked up a um, ingredient to get rid of that. So look forward to a video on how to get diaper rash cream out of your baby stuff or even clothes. Um, yeah, I would show myself except I look a hot mess. It's the end of the day. Just wanted to come on here and say goodnight.